Hello and welcome to this episode of Product of the Week. I'm your host, Robin Mitchell. And in today's special episode, we will be looking at, whoops, a daisy, thank you, Richard, the titan of single board machines, the one, the only, the amazing Zimmerblade. The Zimmerblade is the Arnold Schwarzenegger of single board computers, bulging with a pure masculine energy as it carries immense loads with ease. If this thing was any cleverer, I'm pretty sure it could power a T800 Terminator. Interestingly, this thing was made by a company whose founding project was aimed at fighting against government surveillance. So, as always, hack the planet. To say that the Zimmerblade is an SBC on steroids is an understatement. In fact, this thing is so powerful that the manufacturer actually referred to this thing as a single board server. So yeah, you can imagine it's capable of far more than your average Raspberry Pi. But its small size, plenty of IO and low power consumption compared to typical home servers gives you plenty of options when integrating it into low energy environments, especially when considering how much electricity prices have been rising. Finally, the Zimmerblade has been designed to be open source, meaning that you can hack it to your heart's content without having to face a SWAT team breaking down your door because you decided to open up your legal property. If you have gotten up to this part of the episode and haven't already bought the Zimmer Blade, well, you will definitely want to after we list just a few of its features. To start, at the heart of this single board server is an Intel Celeron D, with the Zimmer Blade 3760 having a dual core clocked at 2.2 GHz, while the 7700 has a quad core clocked at 2.4 GHz. Additionally, both processors have an Intel UHD graphics accelerator. No server would be complete without plenty of RAM, and this machine offers an outstanding 16 gigabytes of DDR3L via a single SOD IMM slot. Onboard memory comes in the form of a 32 gigabyte EMMC flash, but two external SATA 3.0 ports provide expansion to external drives. Despite the Zimmer Blade being geared around server work, its mini display port offers up to 4K resolution at 60 frames per second, and the onboard USB-C connector allows for use as a display port as well. When it comes to server work, a decent LAN connection is everything, and the Zimmer Blade's 1 gigabit per second RJ45 Ethernet port has you covered for even the most intensive tasks. Additional USB slots provide the Zimmer Blade with both power and data connections to external peripherals, and the PCIe 2.0x4 connector allows for extra high-speed hardware to be connected to the Zimmer Blade. Finally, the Zimmer Blade comes with a Debian-based OS called Casa OS, which provides users with a streamlined Docker experience. Whatever that means, I'll just stick with Windows Server because I'm boring and hate terminal commands. Hold up, hold that thought. It actually turns out that Casa OS has a GUI interface, and after seeing it, I must say, it looks pretty darn good. So maybe I will close the curtains on Windows. You pardon the pun. Besides giving all other single board machines an inferiority complex, the Zimmer Blade can be used for any single board computer task that you can think of, and more. To start, the Zimmer Blade is a perfect candidate for use as a server, especially for those used in the home. If connected to a large external drive and located next to a router via a gigabit Ethernet port, the Zimmer Blade can be used for serving media files, streaming video content, and even rendering tasks remotely from a main machine. For example, I use my home server to render chat GPT tasks separately from any of my day-to-day -day machines. The high degree of flexibility with the Zimmer Blade also makes it ideal for developing new hardware accessories. For example, let's say you want to expand the Zimmer Blade with a PCIe enabled Arduino expansion board for the purpose of interfacing with GPIO. Well, with this computer, you can. The open source nature of the Zimmer Blade also makes it ideal for use in security applications when you need to be able to absolutely trust the manufacturer. Basically, if you want to be sure that there are no hidden surveillance chips in your board or in your software, well, you wouldn't have chips in your software, the Zimmer Blade is a great option. 
With this board, you can put away your tinfoil hats as the government attempts to read your data. Or if you are looking for some high performance computing applications, well, the Zimmerblade has you covered there. If you grab yourself a whole bunch of these and stick them together in the network, you can create an x86 cluster, which is great for large distributed computing, maybe to do something like video rendering or very large parallel tasks. It is clear that the Zimmerblade is a beast of a machine. And while there are plenty of other single board computers out there, none come close to the power offered by this machine. Finally, with a base price starting from $64, there is little reason to not switch over to this x86 based machine. This means you can also install normal operating systems such as Windows and most distributions of Linux. If you find the idea of having a Zimmer blade on your workbench titillating and want to support the work that we do here at Electromaker, then head over to the Zimmerboard site where you can grab one of these amazing machines and head over to the Electromaker store where you can find all the bits and bobs that you could possibly need for your future IoT teapot, home server, or hopefully not your T800 assassinator capable of crushing the resistance and finally putting an end to the stain that is mankind. Thank you for watching. I'll be back. Oh, sorry. I mean, I'll see you next time.